thing again. <laughs> All right, we will. Awesome. Okay. So tell me what's your name, what do you do? All right, I'm Annie Stearns. I'm the athletic director for Paradise High School. Awesome. And what did you think about Overall, it was amazing. It was a great experience for the kids. Um, teared up a little bit. Uh, had some emotions that were running high, but it was great to see all the kids laughing and, and having a good time. And I just think that it, it got us in a place where we could feel joy again, and that was really nice to see. Uh, main thing motivating me is just helping the kids. Um, for me, as an athlete myself, I know how important it is to be a part of a community, to be part of something bigger than yourself. And if I can help in any way to make anyone forget about what's going on, I would do that in a heartbeat. Um, the challenges I face right now is it's hourly, it's daily. Uh, right now it's great because I'm getting emails, texts, posts about how much money people want to help and great things that are happening in our community, but I'm having a really hard time connecting with those people because of the fact that there's so many. And I'm trying to really harness that positivity and harness the, those funds that are available and trying to get it to the kids. And so I'm having a really hard time getting getting the word out that I want it or want that help, but I can't I can't do it all, right? And so it's figuring out what the best situation is for the kids, what the best situation is for us as a community that can be the best thing for, for Paradise Unified. Um, I also, just to talk about our athletic program, right now I've gotten a bunch of phone calls about basketball, and I know that sounds silly right now, but we have a game on the 26th, and I don't know if we're going to make it, and that to me is heartbreaking, because I can't see us as Paradise Unified or Paradise High School and not having, having a basketball team, and uh, so right now my main concern is getting those, those girls and those males on the court. Personal challenges, but specifically with the fire. I feel like she wants me to cry. No, uh, no. I, for me, um, I'm just having a really hard time thinking about. Do you know where we are at? About all my kids, like I just don't want them to move away. I want to figure out how we can rebuild and um, how I can help everyone become an amazing um, adult and amazing everything. <laughs> I just love everybody so much, and I just can't I can't imagine a life without without my athletes and without you know a paradise kids around me. Um, I love my job. I've never loved my job more. But I can't. Um, I just can't think of anything better for me to be doing right now. But at the same time, I'm having a hard time because a lot of kids are telling me that they're going to be moving. They're going to go away. So try to get them to stay. But I understand the, the hard, the hard battles we have to even create a community again. So, there's that. Uh, hopeful. I, yeah, I know. I we saw the devastation today. I'm an optimistic person, but I have pessimistic tendencies right now because I just don't. I don't see it happening, but um, I really want it to. I said it wrong. I said it wrong. Anything else? I love being a bobcat. Go green and gold. Please do my. No more we go, okay?